a small setting, but a group of patients, caregivers, and policy managers all talked about their biggest struggles and the biggest issues that they want lawmakers to hurdle over. If you have Alzheimer's, you get, you're not going to be in the work. There was never a silent moment. The, the medicine that goes with Alzheimer's, no, I mean, the PET scans. Okay. Ten women discussed everything from screening and diagnosis to cost for care and the consequences for caregivers. Alzheimer's affects everybody in the family, especially the caregivers. I and mean, we heard today 50% risk of dying uh, before the actual patient if you're a caregiver. The Alzheimer's Association estimates around 3.3 million women over the age of 65 are diagnosed with this disease and nearly 20% of their caregivers end up quitting their jobs to look after their loved ones. Congresswoman Lois Frankel says that needs to change. If I'm going to take these stories that I heard today and uh, back to Washington, talk to my colleagues, see if we can get some interest. These issues impact South Florida more than you may realize. Frankel represents one of the oldest districts in the country. Representative Frankel said leaving here, the first thing she's going to try to do is to get more women in the Women's Caucus and Congress all together so they can make this one of their top priorities. She'll have more help, hopefully, on Capitol Hill, and we'll follow everything that happens.